Hi folks, Dufan and ready to rock and roll with putting action for Monday, June 10th. It is a rainy, blistering, rainy day in sunny Long Island, New York, where the sun, no sun, baby, only clouds, dark as fucking shit, as dark as the San Antonio Spurs feel this morning. As dark as all the people that thought San Antonio had a prayer of beating the NBA champion Miami Heat. There's a reason. The Miami Heat are back in the NBA championship for the third year in a row. Something as good as San Antonio is, has been, has never fucking done. Do you realize we're Duncan and Ginobili and Parker and as smart as Popovich is, he has never gone to back-to-back -back NBA finals. Never! Nada! And yesterday, as advertised, I told you I was betting $10 million on Miami. I told you you can make the biggest bet of your life on Miami. I told you to bet every fucking thing you want after game one on the adjusted series price. Now Miami went from a $2.50 favorite, that was bet down to about a $2 favorite, to a $1.10 underdog. Who the fuck made that line? Can you say jumping the gun? Can you say after game one overreaction? Are you fucking kidding me? LeBron James is the single greatest all-around player ever. Ever, ever, ever. He can score 17 points and still dominate a fucking game. Whether it's his defense, whether it's his pure aura on the field, whether it's setting picks, whether it's making every single fucking pass possible, whether it's drawing the double or the triple or the quadruple team as Miami now. For anybody out there, and all you naysayers that thought, well, it looks like the Heat might get beat again like they did two years ago against the Mavericks, please, give me a fucking break. Please, without Dwayne Wade, without Chris Bosh, Miami goes on a 33-5, and 33-5, and 33-5 run. Please, men against fucking boys. In seven minutes, they took the fucking air and the life out of the state of Texas, out of the city of San Antonio. On the video blog, I discuss what Chris Bosh and Dwayne Wade and LeBron James looked like compared to Parker, Ginobili, and Dunklin. The big three of San Antonio compared to the big three of Miami on the video blog, on the free pick phone. The winner of the Stanley Cup, it will be an epic battle. Boston Bruins, Chicago Black Sox, two of the original six on the free pick phone. The winner of the Stanley Cup for 2013. On the site right now, we have game three winner. This is a game you can bet everything you own on. Plus, I have best bets in baseball. Plus, the Godfather, how we find it again has the parlay, the winner of the game, and the over-under for game three on the site. Let's score out. Let's rock and roll. It's here, motherfucker. We're ready to roll. It is showtime, baby. Let's have an amazing winning day. Let's have an amazing winning day in baseball. Let's blow it into basketball. Let's rock and roll. Game three's up right fucking now. The over-under's up right fucking now. My baseball's up. The Stanley Cup winner is on the pick phone. I am your full-service sports advisor, baby. All you need is me. Let's rock and roll. Let's fuck your bookmaker. Let's